there's a lot of people who think they're going to be successful doing what they're doing in the little town you're in, and that's just a pipe dream. You know, the actions in Nashville, if, you, if you're serious about it and you want to be a professional hit songwriter, you're going to have to come to Nashville. Or L.A. or New York, it, depending on what style of music you're in, you know. I always like what Joe Bibby said. He said, you know, he said somebody told him when he first moved to Nashville, before he moved to Nashville, Hank Thompson or somebody, I don't know. She's still alive. I love her. He said, he said that, you know, if you want to milk a cow, you don't set the stool down out in the middle of the pasture and expect the cow to back up to it. <laughs> you go to where the damn cow is, you know. And the cow's in Nashville. If you want to get some milk from that cow, you best go there sooner or later. I'm Kerry Kirk Phillips, and we're here at the Sandy Lee Songwriters Festival. And today is the third day, the, or the fourth and final day of the festival. And uh, as part of our events today, we have a songwriter seminar, kind of like a round table event where we bring in some the amateur songwriters from the area, some as far away as oh, from several hundred miles away, they come in for this. And this is the second year we've done the seminar. And they, uh, they get to listen, to get to ask questions of the pro writers that are here for the sem that are here for the festival and performing at the festival. They get to ask them any questions about any aspect of the music industry, not only about writing but about publishing and about uh, being an artist or about working any anywhere within the music industry, uh, in country music in, in Nashville, and uh, we answer all the questions and uh, and we spend a little time with them, give them some. Uh, uh, advice and, and some tools that they can use when they uh, uh, further their career as songwriters. You know, a lot of these people have dreams of doing what we've done and, and we try to encourage them and, and give them uh, tools and techniques that we use on a daily basis. So that's the whole purpose of the event. If you don't treat this like a business, you know, you're not going to be successful. Once again, this is a gospel according to Kerry Curry. This is the way I believe, the way I think.